Hello everybody, it's me again, Nico D. So I just made my video about the Zima board. First booth is over here. And uh, I just received this package. So this is my metal case for my Kada, I uh, know for my Rock 5B. So let's open it, where's my scissor? Always have to search for my scissors. Let's first unplug the Rock 5B. So here is my Rock 5B. So I've been using it the last weeks as my main desktop and it works pretty well. So I'm using Armbian Jammy on it. And everything works as it should. Very happy with it. It is an upgrade from my Mekotronics R58 Mini. It is a big box for a case for the Rock 5B. I paid for it with my own money, but I do have a referral link. Uh, so I have 10% off using my referral link. And then I have my coupon code Nico de Carf. With that, you also get 10% off. So if you buy uh, with my referral link, then I get 10%. And then use my coupon code for also 10% off on your purchase. So here it is. Oh, there are different cases. He again sent me more than I asked for, I think. Oh, Raspberry Pi 5 passive heatsink. That's cool. So the one that I got isn't with a heatsink. And what is this? A 7 inch display for the Raspberry Pi 5. What the hell? What the hell? Look at that. Or is it just a case for a 7 inch display? It is the case for the 7 inch display. To put the Raspberry Pi 5 into it, I think. Yes, here the HDMI's, here the... Yeah, that looks great! I'm gonna test this, so I'm gonna order a Raspberry Pi 5 this week and then i can test all these cases so thank you kksb cases i didn't need these but i really wanted i i wanted a case like this the one they sent me before uh, wasn't to keep it cool so i will use these later thank you kksb cases so it is good that i have a referral link they seem to like me so here is the case that I wanted. It isn't very heavy. I hope it will be enough to keep it cool. I think I have to unscrew these. Okay, now it should go open. Yes, it does. Oh, it is a separate heatsink. And doesn't this heatsink fit to, to the case? No, it doesn't. Hmm. So 
some feet, some thermal paste, some screws. So let's try to assemble it. Gonna have to remove that. I got it off. So let's clean this up. Oh, alcohol. So I do like the Rock 5B. It works pretty well right now. In the beginning, there were a lot of bugs. Now they are fixed with patches. But I do not like the design of the ROCK 5B, so all the connectors are on one side. What makes it want to drop towards that side, because all the weight is on one side. The Orange Pi 5B, no the Orange Pi 5 Plus doesn't have that. And I think the Orange Pi 5 Plus is the best designed or K3588. Well, I'm not gonna get it any more clean, so I don't know how this will fit. Probably like this. But how is it? Okay, I think this fits onto here. I will need some screws for that. Okay, so this goes like that, so that goes in like this. I'll have to re-plug my SSD, my NVMe. Okay, so now the tall screws or the small screws? I don't know. Okay, so the board is inside of the case. Now, oh, this is very thin. That is very good. It is paper thin. That's gonna be hard to get the plastic off. It is ultra thin. Oh. 
Okay. Now let's attach this. Let's see if it makes an impression. That should be good. Let's close it again. <coughs> Put the feet on. Sorry, I wasn't talking. I forget, forgot that the camera was on. So it is inside of the case. It wasn't that hard to assemble. I've got two screws left. Two wrong screws that I might have used in the wrong side. So it does look pretty nice. It looks a lot better than it used to. Let's try to use these screws. So this is it. All screwed down. So you've got a power button, reset button, here the mini uh, micro HDMI in. Room for GPIO, flat cable, audio, USB C, two times HDMI out, USB 3. So yeah. Looks pretty nice. Now let's check how the thermals are. So the results are in and it isn't great, but it is better than the heatsink that I was using. So the heatsink that I was using was overheating because it didn't make good contact because it always was crooked on the sock. So this heatsink clearly makes contact. It gets very, very hot. So after about 25 minutes of all cores maxed out, it goes to 80 degrees and up to 83 degrees. So that is pretty high. It does throttle a little bit, but not too much. For me, the biggest improvement is that it is a little bit heavier and that it sits on those legs. Like that, it has a little bit more grip on my table and it will not fall off every time that I move my table. I wish the thermals were a little bit better. I've got other RK3588s with better thermals. I do think from sock to sock that there is a difference in temperatures. So my ROCK 5B probably has a lesser sock. But I'm very happy with this case. If you want to buy one, please use my affiliate link and use the coupon code for 10% off. So that will be it for today. Thank you all for watching. See you all later. Bye.